The Dark Masters cannot fill the heart center for they are set within the power centers and the inner direction of the heart is blocked and the barriers are in place and they avoid feeling this center and they avoid what is growing within it. This is where the greatest change is coming and the teachers of light speak to the center and call forth the heart to open and understand the oneness of all life. The Dark Masters are adepts in keeping the followers separated which traps them in fear by maintaining the lies about the past. The presumption, the lie, the deception is the primal focus and programmed into the masses upon birth into the third dimension. The Dark Masters work and re-energize the program and the propaganda to manipulate the world and take the power from the believers. History and meaning are manufactured. The great deception is a grand illusion of power, a fantasy pushed with images, symbols, and legacies from the past to instill an aura of greatness and authority over the ignorant equals. The Dark Masters disempower the egos of the masses. By using this focus and direction, where events are only the dream images of such, which is a fourth dimensional magic, the Black Alliance confuses the reactive mind with deceptions and illusions. From this darkened world of massive lies and incredible dishonesty being sent through the media channels, the masses sleep in a nightmare of shallow awareness of their powerful heritage and equal creative ability. The teachers of light are patient with this plane of existence, for it is just one dimension with innumerable realities. The earth plane has its timeline and it's important that the masses of followers awaken and see the world, enjoy the higher mind existence, and see the grounding of the vertical rays of interdimensionality. Multidimensional beings are able to perceive the energy flow that comes through the crown chakra, through the receptacle, which empowers the heart chakra and allows forth the coming of the higher intelligence. These beings are the teachers of light. The teachers of light speak to those who seek answers for that which is not of them. You have sought the way to achieve happiness and success. You request it, yet it is an allowing that will give you this peace of mind and fulfillment of your soul. It is not an aggressive working out of the reality where you are to focus your energy. It is to bring yourself in compliance with the higher vibration that are sent via higher intelligence that wish the accomplishment of your desire. You will see and know the first wave, and in the acceptance of the new rays of light, your heart will receive grace. The Black Alliance has deceived you to believe in a lie, a fact they say that you are not motivated by love, but by dark forces, demons, that have invaded your body and have possessed it. They use religion as their main weapon to make you afraid of the non-physical, to be scared of death, to be fearful of spirit, and to see God as weak and distant. They use the words of fear, terror, violence, and abuse to keep you wary of goodness, peace, and safety. The dark masters use the words, yet their intent is to deceive. They understand only the nature of the third and fourth dimensional creation. The Black Alliance is about to see itself in the mirror of existence and deal with the thought forms it has given power to. The courage of thought of those who walk the path of the freedom fighter in their anger and frustration are misguided in what they can accomplish. The Black Alliance seeks those who resist with the same anticipation as those who act on their behalf to enslave, control, and dominate. The energy of this time is about the outpicturing of the great dance between those who want change and those who think they cannot change. The Dark Masters of the Black Alliance seek to keep the mind focused on the illusion of the past, that which they say is destroyed, broken, charged with irrational energy and motivated by fear. From fear there exists anger, from anger their result is pain, in pain there is confusion and stress, from stress there is the compromise of integrity. With the loss of integrity movement ceases and the energy weakens and there is paralysis and dissolution. There is remorse in the failure to connect with the higher energy, and so there is the giving up in despair. 
there is the loss of energy, and that is when the Dark Masters come like scavengers to eat the carrion of your lower dimensional being. The Great Awakening is the alignment of the great wheels of the galaxies, which are being lined up in this manner to accelerate the evolution. This is occurring as it should due to the mind's required manifestation of desire. It is asked that humanity's wish and request the Golden Age to correspond to the events of this era. The divine reality of this alignment continues as the infinite has power to sustain, regenerate, and enlighten itself. In the same way the mind has created the challenge of the apocalypse, the old world view, and the ancient prophecies are bringing to an end this powerful revolutionary transformative era. The truth of the mind is that it is the being of the body that is the controlling creative factor in this shared destiny. This destiny is manifesting the fullness of your multidimensional being. When fully manifest, you are fully conscious a creative cell in the body of what you consider God, which is the timeless infinite conscious collective. This force, which is the I am of every omnicentric person who is breathing upon the planet and all who have lived before and all who will live, is already part of the essence of the infinite being. As the Octurian alignment unfolds, the Wayshores become the bringers of light on the behalf of the teachers of truth. This will break the paradigm of the dark masters, and there will be a great awakening. awakening, 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 awakening.